Capricorn, hey, it is your girl. I am back with your weekly reading, honey. Mm. So, you know, my readings is just considered as a heads up, okay? This may resonate with you and it may not. And this may be going on in your life right now or about to happen, Capricorn, okay? All right, Cap. So, listen. Y'all know I've already laid out your spread. Y'all know somebody commented and said... Uh, why is everybody staging their readings? I said, what do you mean by staging a reading? And they was like, are, like just laying the cards out there. Honey, I do not lay the cards out there. I, I pull these cards. I draw these cards. Like, I'll shuffle them until they fall out, okay? Honey, I like sage. I got spirit all up and through this thing. I just want to let you know, I do not stage cards, okay? And that's what somebody thinks. Because a lot of people, a lot of tarot readers, like, you can't see their hands while they're shuffling. Or you can't, you know, or their cards is already laid out. Some of them you can't see the cards at all. You just see the person. But I just wanted to put that out there that I do not save cards. Okay. Okay. So let's see what you got going on, Capricorn. Y'all are so hard to read. Like y'all give me a go for my money every time. Like for real. Y'all hard to read. But anyway, you got the world card right here and your middle card is what life wants you to know. And it says you need some fucking yoga in your life, honey. Ancient shit is cool. Okay. And you got the world card right here. That's endings for new beginnings, okay? Like you're being free. Like you feel freely, okay? So, Capricorn. You look like you... Oh, and I got a new deck, y'all. Look. Bam. Yes. Look at this. Mm-hmm. I ain't saying that. It's called the, uh, the Tarot Illuminati. Okay, so that's what life wants you to know right now. Do some yoga. Yoga's good for you. Okay, so listen, I see you looking all good. You're looking good, Capricorn. You're looking good. You look like you are, like, satisfied. You got, you know what I'm saying, everything together. Like, you're just sitting around chilling. you you stable as hell, okay? You got your stability together. And I feel like that you're sitting back and you're looking good. You done worked hard for what you got, you know what I'm saying? And I feel like that, um, that you, um, you know, you've, uh, like made a decision to stay blocked <clears throat> you made a decision to stay blocked okay and you moved away from something and now this is a new you i told you that this is freely right here like you have moved away from something honey and this is like this is a, a new you this is a rebirth okay and i feel like that you're being stubborn and you're not refusing nothing right now and you're taking action on that fast action and i think you're standing on that you like if it don't serve me if it don't look good i don't want it okay it's something about a third party situation right here. Okay? But we're going to figure it out with this uh, Tarot Illuminati on what's going on. Why is the King of Pentacles here? The Capricorn. King of Pentacles. Both, see? Somebody didn't have a third party situation or something. Let's look at here. This is what you got. You got the Ace of Cups and you got the um, Queen of Wands, honey. And that's being passionate about yourself and not accepting no, no offers. And I told you, you looking good with your stability and everything. And you worked hard for what you got. And I feel like that you ain't accepting no offers. That I feel like that you putting all this passion and love into yourself, Cap. Yeah, because see, this person right here knows what they want. They know what they want, honey. And they not accepting no offers. And I feel like that you are loving yourself right now. And you looking good while you doing it. You looking damn good while you're doing it. But it says you need some yoga. Shoot. Go on and go take yoga classes. Focus on you. Okay? Because, listen, you done been through something. And there, this is your completion for a new beginning. But you feel freely. Whatever it is that you have been through. Okay? And I feel like that you have made the decision to, to guard yourself. And move away from a situation. This is a rebirth. Let's keep going. Okay? Let's see what you got going on. Y'all normally hard to read. Why the two of swords here? Why the two of swords here? The Capricorn. The two of swords. Okay. Oh shit. This is what you got here, honey. This is what you got. Mm-hmm. Look at you. You made a decision to be blocked. Like I said, I feel like that you have chose to love yourself, Capricorn, and you're not accepting no offers or nothing. You know who the hell you are, okay? You are a boss bitch. You don't need nothing from nobody, okay? 
you just bossing up because I'm talking about all of this right here is straight boss shit right there and you really just bossing up and look this is the star card right here honey this is knowing who the hell you are this is like uh, having faith and having hope in who you are you know what I'm saying like you know who you are honey and I feel like that you have made a decision to like step into your power and know that you are the star okay look because you know that this is what you deserve this is the ten of pentacles right here this is an empire this is a the happy family just everything honey money you know this is everything that you could want and i feel like that you have made a decision to step into that right there okay i feel like that you have set back and you have used your intuition you know and you took action you have took action and you mean it you mean business you have moved away from things and this is a rebirth right here Ooh, go on Capricorn. See, that's what I found about. Hey, looking good, baby. Why's the chariot here? Why's the chariot here? Oh shit, honey. Whatever you moved away from, you was supposed to. Because guess what? They was the devil, or it was the devil. Whatever you moved away from, you felt tied into it. You know what I'm saying? It, it wasn't no good for you. It was the devil energy. You had to move away from it whatever that was and that's a good thing capricorn because look you didn't uh you know you didn't now you know who you are and now here go this rebirth right here you feel me like this is a new you this is a new you and whoever's trying to offer you love you like hell no i don't want that shit i had to leave that alone okay because you know who the hell you are and that's good come on capricorn i feel you why is it good in the car here why the judgment card here for the cat? The judgment. Why the judgment card here for Capricorn? Yes, honey. Look, the world card. See what I said? Look, this is freely. This is a new you. This is you being free. This is you being free, honey. This is a completion for a new beginning. I told you a, a rebirth. You have been reborn. Shoo. That's the world card, and that's the world card right there. That's what your overall energy is about. I told you, you had put an end to that old you, honey, and you didn't figure out who the hell you are up here. Whatever this shit is up here with the devil, you didn't move away from that because you knew it was the devil, okay? And now, here's, here's this rebirth. Here's this rebirth right here, you know? Now you are ready for this new beginning. This new beginning, you ain't accepting nothing. That was probably love that you left away from right there. Something about love. You left it alone. You left that alone right there. And then now they probably study trying to offer it to you and you don't want it because you know who you are. And you took action fast on that because you said, hell no, this is all in my head. It's just an illusion, okay? And that person could have even been in um, third party situations or it could have been a whole lot of partying going on, period, okay? Like whatever was going on, whatever it is that you moved away from, honey, you don't want nothing to do with it. You put it down. You know who the hell you are. Let's keep going. Why the four cups here? For Capricorn. Why the four cups here for Capricorn? The four cups here for Capricorn. See, look. You like, if it ain't loving, if it ain't nurturing, I ain't accepting it. Okay? If it ain't loving, if it ain't nurturing, I am not accepting it. You don't want it. If that love ain't loving, and nurturing you don't want nothing to do with it and you took action on that fast because it's all in your head it was all in your head or it was all in their head and you know that and you, you moved away from it now you know this is like this new you. you you all about being loving and nurturing you know what i'm saying you probably got kids you know i don't know but if it ain't got nothing to do with loving and nurturing you don't want nothing to do about it and you took action on that fast okay and somebody probably trying to send you messages or something. You're like, mm-mm, because you know it was just an illusion. Okay? It was probably a lot of partying going on, or it was either a third-party situation. Somebody was messing with somebody else. It was a third-party situation going on. Okay? Let's keep going. Why's the eight of wands here? Why's the eight of wands here? The eight of wands for Capricorn. Why is the eight of wands there for Capricorn? The eight of wands for Capricorn. The messages for Capricorn. The eight of wands. Mm-hmm. So you took action on that fast because it started to stress you out. 
whatever it was that, that was going on caused you to be all up in your head thinking like having probably all these crazy thoughts like I said you probably was like hell no nah, that was just an illusion I was all up in my head I ain't gonna let that shit stress me out whatever was going on okay you took action on that shit fast like hold up wait a minute this is 22 nah. <laughs> uh -uh, but you was not playing cap okay why is the moon car here for Capricorn? Why is the moon card here for Capricorn? The moon card. Mm hmm. That's a good thing, though. You got on down. Whenever there's devilish energy around, honey, you gotta go. And you realize that shit, you was like, no. Okay? This is what you got. You got the Four of Cups. On top of it, it was all up in your head. And now you knew to refuse it. You was like, no, I'm not accepting it. I don't give a damn. I'm not accepting it. I don't want nothing to do with it. Okay? No. You don't care who's trying to give it to you. I don't want it. That's being stubborn or whatever. You're not accepting it. Okay? you like, I'm cool with this little love right here. I don't need it. If it's the devil, if it's got something to do with the devil, I don't want nothing to do with it. Let's see why this uh, Three of Cups is here. Why is the Three of Cups here for uh, Capricorn? I keep on saying Sag because I, I don't know if I said Sag or not, but I just got to go in Sagittarius and read it. Why is the Three of Cups here for Capricorn? The Three of Cups. You got the Emperor. See, if it was a third party situation now, or if it was a whole lot of, um, like, partying going on, whatever it is that was the devil and you cut out, honey, you were serious about it. You you didn't come to play. You being super serious. Like, nope, I'm not even, I don't even want to look at it because it was all in my head. You understand? Like, I don't even want to look at it. it. It caused me to be too stressed out, okay? And I'm not accepting it. And I'm serious and I'm standing on that. Look how they sitting in that chair. Fan plan. They ain't playing at all. Like, uh uh, I'm the shit and I know that. And I'm not putting up with this. And I, I, bet, you, I bet you it was a third party situation. You're not putting up with it. Not at all. Yep, and you did that on your own. You sat down and you thought about it for a minute and you was like, nope, I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it, okay? And you found that balance within yourself to step down and step away from it. All right, Capricorn, that's your reading, honey. Okay? I hope it resonated with you. If it did, hit the like button, even comment, you know. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed so you can be notified when my next videos come out, okay? Thanks for stopping by my channel, Capricorn. Have a blessed day.